people your only son be addressed a madman in Kumalo Kingdom. Father, I think I demand an explanation to this inhuman treatment degree against the prince. Kezina, you are but a child that knows nothing about the norms of this kingdom. Your brother is under a spell. And until that spell is averted, he will remain under custody. Father, what, what spell are you talking about? What spell are you talking about? There is nothing wrong with Kera. Prince Kera is okay. Father, I can swear with my life that he's fine. Now you see why I say that you're nothing but a child. Which normal human being will want to marry a spirit? Not just a spirit, but the goddess princess of Kumalo Kingdom. That is total insanity. No, that boy must remain under custody. Until I find the root of all this. Father, Father, please, temper justice with mercy. Father Prince Kara is my only brother, and I wouldn't want anything to happen to him. Father, please. <laughs> Father, please. Kezina. Go back to your heart. This matter is beyond you, and I need to be left alone. Father, please, please, Father, please. Father, Leave my presence now. Leave my presence. Are you here by this time of the day, great prince of Kumado Kingdom? Because I know lions never rule for nothing. Besides, how was your journey to the forest of the goddess princess? Wise one, that is much more why I'm here. The journey was an odyssey that added more confusion to my life. Confusion, you said? Yes. Her beauty is so charming. Her dance steps so captivating. Her music is so glamorously harmonic in nature, which breaks my marrows. I just can't explain. The sight of our royal maidens was so gallanted with light and highly spirited in nature for service. Wise one, I know my choice of wife is an abomination, but could it be a spell or an enchantment to love a goddess? <laughs> Kiara. That was one of the reasons I refused to bring here. But you won't listen. The same thing a dog sees and back uncontrollable was the same. A good son and quietly walk past. Worst one. Can I marry the goddess? He that plays the drum beat of death should be ready to dance the dance of death. It can only be answered if only you answer this question. Ask your question, wise one. If the sun is so powerful, why can't it shine in the night as does the moon in the day? No matter how powerful the sun is, it can never shine in the night. Because sun and night never intermingle, <laughs> just like day and night never meet. Very good. Very good answer. 
So it is, Kiara. Go home and ease yourself from this mystery. Because no mortal can either mingle with immortals. I hope your father is not aware of this. Wise one, I told my father every day when I returned from the goddess forest. My father's joy was torn into sorrow when he heard my story. His king's men walked away without saying a word when they heard the name of the one I love. My father commanded that I should be locked up in the palace prison because he thought I was bewitched. But you know, as it's impossible to, to imprison the air, I smuggled my way out here. The quest of the one I love. You are making a very big mistake, Kiara. You cannot marry a spirit being. Okay. But can I be given access to talk with her? Kiara. <laughs> a trap is set for you. Your quest is one out of the spell. Casted on you from the underworld. This is exactly the year the goddess princess uses the head of a prince to bat. And I believe she is responsible for all that is happening to you now. She wants to use your head for her festival of dance and blood. If you doubt me, Look into this calabash. I want the head of the Prince of Kumalo Kingdom. Why would she choose the Crown Prince of Kumalo Kingdom? <laughs> Once after every 21 years, the Goddess Princess uses the head of her subject to remove her powers. And it must be a prince. This is another 21 years. And you are her parents. Wise one, I will be the last prince that will end this sacrilege in Kumalo. There can be a way out, Kiara. If only you can be brave and very courageous. Though no one sees her and leave. But because you are her targets, she will not kill you until the day of her festival of dance and blood. I will want you to go and lay her into forgetting her plans. Because she is highly romantic and charming. It's in your hand to change your destiny. Take it into your hands. And do not be afraid. Because it is only the toughest that can strive to the end when the going get tough. I am ready to take my destiny into my hands. If I die, it's gain. It's better to die for something than live for nothing. Do not let her confuse you with her words. Remember, she is highly romantic and charming. Many mighty warriors in time pass ended their journey of life on her laps. Do not be tricked and forget soon by her rumors. Always remember your name mission. And don't allow your mission to land crash on her laps. I will be leaving first thing in the morning. Farewell, great prince of the morning. Thank you. Where is my son? Your Majesty. We have searched everywhere within this kingdom, but he's nowhere to be found. You are speaking from the side of your mouth. Jiga, I want you to bring back my son before night falls. I don't want you coming back to this palace telling me stories again. Heads, heads will roll. Now go. Go and find him! As it pleases you, my lord, your majesty. Go now! Your Highness. Jiga, where is my son? Why are you back here without my son? By the way, what happened? Why are you bleeding? Your Majesty, we met him at the boundary that leads to Guyana Forest. We enticed him to follow us home, but he refused, saying 
is embarking on a journey in search of his loved one who engage him in a fight as to overpower him and bring him back home. But he fought with his mystical power and disappeared into the big tree that leads to Guyana Forest. After killing one of us, Your Highness, we tried our best, but the Prince Kiara was no more fighting with his ordinary power. I think the gods assisted him. Jiga, you disappointed me. Now, get out of my sight. I am sorry, Your Highness. Sorry is the only thing you know how to say. Just pray that nothing happens to my son. Else, I'll skin all of you alive. Your Highness, now go and bury the dead. I choose five. Something is bothering me. Are you happy? No. Are you happy? No. How long are we going to sit here and watch that heartless goddess use our crown prince for the sacrifice of our so-called festival of dance and blood? No. 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 Then, if your responses are all no, we need to act now. Please, 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 Sina. I do not want to remember about that prince anymore. Is it not the same prince that molested us as the Countess of Dance? Mm -hmm. The one who made us so abandon our betrothed? Mm -hmm. Especially, especially my Pego. <laughs> he loves me so much. He was supposed to be the father of my unborn children. Oh, my friend. At the end of it, what happened? We were all rejected and abandoned by our loved ones. I think that same seems right. I don't even want to hear his name anymore. Silo. Ah, don't forget that we are talking about our crown prince here. Eh? Let's just forget about our selfish interests and the thing the way out to rescue our crown prince from that heartless goddess. Please. Besides, whatever that transpired in that context of dance was not the fault of our prince. Thank you. We are all made to understand that the prince was under a spell. A spell casted by that same goddess of ours. That is why he did not choose any of us. Yes, exactly. Yes. It's not his fault at all. Mm -hmm. Come to think of it, we are mere mortals. Oh. How can we fight a heartless goddess? Because if we don't trade with caution, I bet you the hunter can turn to be hunted. May the God bless right. you. Mm, that's true. The point. Yes. You are making a point. Fear not. Maidens of Kumalo Kingdom. Like they told us that the goddess mother is the mother to all of us. And I believe she's going to hack into our plea and release our cramping. So how many of you are ready to go with me? We are we all ready, ready to put, put our time, time to this village. village. Tilo, you don't say anything. Mm -hmm. You don't want to rescue this thing. I do not have anything to Tilo, say. Tilo, come on, we are all in this. Tilo. Ah, we all are in this. We are all affected too. Please. Forgive and forget. Mm -hmm. Well, it's all right. I'll oh, go with my friend. Hey. Hey. I said yeah. goodbye. Hey. Are we all ready to go now? Yes, yes. we are ready, ready, ready to put some time to this exactly. Please, Kara. Please, Kara. Where do you think you are going? I seek the path of my destiny. And not even you can stop me. Which destiny? Are you talking about? Kira, your destiny is to be offered as a sacrificial lamb. And there is no way that. You lied! You lied! It is your skeletal bones that shall be used for sacrifice and not the crown prince of Kumano Kingdom. My destiny I seek, my destiny shall I reclaim. Ha 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 ha! Come and reclaim your destiny. Let us see. Capture him. Yes. My destiny.
destiny I seek and my destiny shall I get back? <sighs> 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 Come back. Let's go.
Fallow Kingdom. Lucky are you to find favor in Marlborough. No mother has ever set eyes on the beauty of the goddess princess and lived to tell the story. But your case is different. You've not only seen me, but you've also felt the once welcome of the spirit. Crown Queens of Kumalo Kingdom. What? Goddess of purity, love and power, deck and majesty, supreme in authority, array in glory. Who am I to be high, giving this peaceful passage into the territory where you reign supreme? Thank you for sparing my life. I am full in my heart in search of my true love and mortal perfection. Prince of Kumari, you have spoken well. Indeed, you've proven to me that what runs through you is the blue blood of royalty. Your words are like royal spices, garnished for queens and kings. I have what you seek. But you must promise me one thing that you will never return back to the land of the mothers. Then everything, everything you want will be at your disposal. This shall all unfold itself at the snap of your fingers. And I shall also crown you the prince of my kingdom. You know what that means? I and my maidens shall ravishly yield to all who said your feelings. And you shall be quickly satisfied. Great goddess of beauty. Once again I want to thank you for sparing my life and counting me worthy of this great honor to die in a wife the great and dread of Your condition is okay by me. If only my request is granted. Beautiful, beautiful response, Prince Kara. You know my name already? Kumalo Kingdom and its totality are my subjects. The names of its habitats are written here in my palms. I chose what to do with my subjects, which you are one of them. Your father happens to be the next to donate for my festival of dance and blood. Please, goddess of all spirits, spare the life of my father, for I know too well he can object your request. <laughs> His life is already spared because my quests are best. all over till after my festival. How would you choose the Crown Prince of Kumalo Kingdom? Once after every 21 days, the Goddess Prince chooses the head of her subject to be Wow! Festival? When will this festival be commencing? Because I would love to partake. Prince, you are the essence why this festival will commence. This festival holds after every 21 years. It is not a yearly thing.
of Sakbewa, the only cripple that climbed the tallest tree in Kumalo Kingdom. We, the maidens of Kumalo, we are here to seek justice. Oh, you are the mother that we are told. You feed the poor. Oh, you give life to the lifeless. We have tread the path of human and spirit. And yeah, we have found you. Yeah, in my heart is the sacrifice to seek that you mothers of all should release our country. The palace needs a prince. The king's men need a prince. Accept the sacrifice and release our prince now. Yes, we need our prince. Yes. Great mother. We keep evil without and peace within. Great mother of life, he needs our son. Burdens of death and blood save the lives of Kumalo Kingdom. Arise, your spirit, for I am by circumstances led from your mystical, most serious powers. You are far, far dreadful than the mortals. I am pleading for mercy. Have mercy upon the king. Have mercy upon the people of Kumalo Kingdom. The kingdom is scattered. Oh, beautiful mother. My name is Silo. The granddaughter to Oblan Tamana. The great granddaughter of Edom Koko Goddess. The only woman in Kumalo Kingdom who travel from the oceans to the rivers of no returns. Her life was spared. I gathered the life of my grandmother and my great grandmother to save the life of our prince. Release the future king of Kumala Kingdom. Have mercy. These are all the maidens of Kumala Kingdom. So many lives were gone and buried. So many lives could not be seen in the life of Kumalo Kingdom. The kingdom is scattered. Our skin is tired and silent. Save the life of the queen! Yes! We need our queen! We need the future king of Kumalo Kingdom! Mother of all, the most beautiful goddess of all, I am Sura. The granddaughter of Leate, the most beautiful woman that I've ever seen in Kuala Kingdom. Please, mother, I am here to plead for mercy. Please release our crown prince. Yes, yes release, release our prince. Our goddess princess. My name is Viale, the daughter of Le, the only woman that sacrificed herself for the future purpose of the maidens of Kumalo Kingdom. We, the ladies of Kumalo Kingdom, we have come to put an end to this sacrilege. 
We ask that you release our prince. Yes, release our prince. prince. Please, please, great mother. Great mother of spirit. Spare their lives. They have but little children. They don't know what they do. Please. I shall be back. <laughs> Your Highness, have you seen what the stupidity of your son? Of course, the innocent daughters of Kumano Kingdom, especially my own daughter. Sayana, shut up your mouth. Who is that your daughter? To be compared to the crown prince of this kingdom. Eh? Instead of a crown prince, he should be one of us. Uru, I don't blame you. I don't blame you because your daughter is not among them. Those maidens are fools to have risked their life to someone who rejected them and wished to marry to a spirit instead. My elders, it's enough. It is my son we are talking about here. Your crown prince. Who knows what the gods have determined to do amongst us? Those maidens who lost their lives we are proud to do so for the Crown Prince. This festival can never be forgotten in this kingdom. This is no time for you to rain blames, but time for you to remain sober because unorthodox things have befallen our great kingdom. I am very adroit of words, but I pray that the gods will give us the fortitude to bear the loss. Your Highness, I think something bad is about to happen. What more than the brutal killing of the Crown Prince for the Festival of Dance and Blood? Stop giving us unexpected hope. I think the end determines the means. And I think that after the festival, we can conclude. Don't be so confident. Do not be so sure. Because no one goes there and comes back alive. My elders, please go home and have a rethink. Kumalu Kingdom mourns for her death. Take her. We are mere messengers in the hand of time. No one is short of time. Your Highness, we better take our leave. Goddess light in her powers, and no one, one of a woman, can bring her down. She died it cautiously. Wise one, I've gone to find quest for this moment. I'd rather die than cower like a coward. Tell me what it takes to bring Oyana home. Bringing her home is not a problem.
myself liberty for second they can just because I want to get married to a spirit who does that uh, liberty don't be too harsh on matter concerning this issue I think the prince is on the path of destiny what destiny are we talking about here is it destined to be sacrificed by the gods I think he deserves the birth at least now all the adorable maidens in this kingdom can now be mine I pity those foolish maidens who lay their lives for him I'm very concerned because it is a shortage on our side. Makati, mind what you say. We're talking about the crown prince here. Yeah. I will bloody cares. Who bloody cares? Is it not the same prince that betrayed us and made our betrothers left us for the sake of nothing? And I warn you all, but especially you, you wouldn't listen. If not that the gods intervened, you would have been sent into the state of total unconsciousness. Why are we bothering ourselves over someone who's in there? Enjoying yourself with the goddess. Yes. Brothers, let's talk about something else, okay? And forget about these old wounds, okay? It won't, it won't help us. I hope we are still setting our traps tonight. Yeah, I think so. So where do we get up from here? We'll meet in my compound. Okay. Okay, by me. Good fun of you. What's wrong with this one? Oh, your job. Chris Kara! Your time to be mortalized at the corner. I know you have no objection. Yes, no objection. Please. That is exactly why I'm here in the first place. Set me free now, so that I also can enjoy the joy of freedom. Please. My days of the greatest and dreaded one. Let him be loose unto his transition. Before the coming of a great mother,
of the gods. Where is my son? Welcome to my domain, great king of Kumalo Kingdom. What he heard was true, but that was few hours back. What do you mean, wise one? Don't tell me that my son is dead. The son has decided to take his life into his hands in order to reclaim his destiny. The body of your son lies lifeless in my inner chamber. I see him back on the soul travel to the forest of Goyana to end her immortality so that he can marry her. That will take in seven reckless days of several battles. If he succeeds, we rejoice. But if otherwise, we cannot blame the gods. But wise one, why will you encourage my son to take such questionable risk? I tried my best to stop him, your highness, but he insisted. Who performed the rituals? Because I know that wouldn't have been possible without some enchantment. <laughs> you know your son too well, your highness, that he is dumb and very brave. He mounted pressure on me to do it, and I was left with no choice. Can I at least see his body? Sure. Where is the goddess princess? She is the one lying there. But for now, your highness, I am speechless. Because our expectation will be a mere fertility if the prince do not return. But if he does, she will be granted mortality to live among men. In that case, wise one, I will come back on the seventh day to make welcome the prince of Kumalo Kingdom. Make sure you try your best to assist him when the situation demands. <laughs> your Highness, I shall monitor all his moves. But it is not easy as you think. Hmm. Well, I will try my best. Farewell, the great and wise year of Kumalo. May you live long, Madam Maya Tua Tua of Kumalo Kingdom. May the peace of the gods be with you.
Prince Kiara, reach out the earth close to you. That is her life. Scatter it with your bare hands, and she will be shattered into pieces. Still keeping my son in the world of the spirit. Go do 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 yo go yo go no do 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 yo go yo. Go do 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 yo go yo go no do do. Hakapara pa ye ku no kuru le ne na magaba. Go do 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 yo go yo go no do do. The prince is in a very big nest. If he cannot break out before six hours, that means he is gone. Wise one, can't you render a helping hand to rescue him from the nest? <laughs> Whoever that beat the trumpet of death should be ready to dance the dance of death. Prince Kiara's fight is spiritual. He and he alone is required in the fights. No helping hand is needed. Gods of Kumalo Kingdom. Please protect and vindicate my son so that
It is a joyful day. A joyful day. A joyful day. Joyful day. Joyful day. Father, brother, you're here dancing alone. Why the villagers are dancing with Goyana and Prince Kara? My princess, I am too excited to go out there and dance before my people. I may disgrace myself. I am not only happy that my son is back. I am happy because Guyana, who has been terrorizing this kingdom, is now a mortar. So I have no reason to go after you. Father, please now come with me now. Father, I can't wait. I'm going. So I am my